Hello everybody, we're back. Let's get him. Mother, Mom, no, oh, it's not really Mom. There's nothing I can do. His magic was keeping her alive. I knew you would come. Don't move, Mother. We'll find a way to... Shh. Don't fret, darling. That man would have kept me trapped in here. Now, I'm free. I get to see Bethany again. And your father. But you'll be here alone. I should have watched over you more closely. I should have... My little girl has become so strong. I love you. You've always made me so proud. Mom? Oh. Ah, I'm so mad now. You have... Ah. Ah. Uh, now I will direct my rage towards the next thing I see. Did you find her? <laughs> Looks like it's Cameron. I'm sorry, Uncle. She's gone. You were right about the flowers and everything. I I can't believe she's gone. I was too late. So you're to blame. If you'd been quicker or stronger, you could have... She could be... <laughs> Why her? Why Leandra? Mother's gone. Will knowing why ease the pain? No, it won't. It will always seem senseless, won't it? Where's the one who did this to her? Did you find the person who killed Leandra? He's dead. It won't bring Leandra back, but I'll take comfort in knowing that. Carver needs to be told. I'll send a message to the Grey Wardens and hope it reaches him. Take care, my dear. I need to direct my rage. I don't know what to say, but I am here. Fenris! Oh, I can't direct my rage at Fenris. Am I to blame for not saving her? I could say no, but would that help? You are looking for forgiveness, but I'm not the one who can give it to you. I know. I know you can't, Fenris, but... But still... I could have left the amulet in there and forgotten all about it. What would the witch have done then? Well, I got my wish. Mom moved out. I can't bring myself to change anything about Mother's room. Mom... Gosh, I'm so sad now. I'm so sad. Like, I'm literally upset about this. Seriously. Oh, I don't know how to feel, but sad. Hey, Bodon. I'm certain you'll find everything's in order, Miss Air. <laughs> But everything's not in order. I want to go home. We can go back to Ferelden. I laid it. I'm so sorry. Mistress Mel was a fine woman. 
reminded me of my own mother. If there's anything I can do. Thank you, Modon. <laughs> but I'm too sad. This is what happens in games like these. I get, I get figuratively just, I'm sad right now. I, seriously, I'm sad. The sniffles are not from a cold. It's because I'm sad. Okay. Pull it together. I have mail that I should be attending to. It better not be from Carver. <laughs> no, I'm okay. I'm okay. Please come speak to me and only me and my key, but as a matter of utmost privacy and urgency, and I can trust this to no one else, but I can't do more. <gasps> oh god. No, I can't do it anymore. I quit. I quit. I'm going home. I'm going back to Lothering. Or what's left of Lothering. <laughs> I'm going back to Feralden. I know I'm being dramatic. <clears throat> it's okay. Friendly concern, Dr. Varric. Talk to Aveline. Send a shield to Aveline. Aveline, Aveline, Aveline. And more Aveline. No. I already read the letter. already read the letter. What do you want from me, Quest? I already read it. Oh, I didn't hit accept. Okay. In my duress, I did not accept the letter. Okay. Let's do this for the third time now. Where do I go to talk to Aveline? Oh, let's go talk to Varric. <sighs> this is where if I was playing a male character, I'd grow like a, like a hobo depression beard and... I seem to recall you saying something a while ago. Who? Shut up. I can control it. Wasn't that what you said? So help me. <laughs> oh. Aww. I think he's mad at him. Hi, Varric. And then Hawk tore the door clean off its hinges, walked into the room, and... <clears throat> I guess we'll finish this later. Have you got a minute, Varric? For you, I have all the time in the world. Actually, I've been meaning to talk to you. About... This is the best tavern in Kirkwall. No. It could use some cute dwarven serving girl. Yeah, but you wanted to talk to me. What the hell, Varric? I thought you wanted to talk to me. I'm so confused. I did talk to her. That's perfect. But see, he's still. He's still got a quest thingy above him. Will that go away if I put him in my party? <laughs> you have to go, Sebastian. You. 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 There. This is the no, best he still like wants to talk to me. I'm so confused. <laughs> I can't deal with these things right now. I'm still mourning the loss of my mother. I'm still mourning the loss of my mother, guys. <laughs> oh, you guys. That's what I don't understand. Like, little Varric. I guess I have to go here to give her that shield. And talk to her about my mom. My mom! <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. Keep it together, Shelly. Keep it together. No. Oh. Good luck getting in. I've been waiting all day. Don't give me any lip. Rage. Rage. I don't have any rage right now. 
Orc. I don't care what else is going on. We haven't spoken about Leandra. How are you? I'm... I'm not fine. My mother is dead. My heart's broken. I suppose I could say, at least you knew yours. But that seems more about me than you. I just have flashes of impossibly long hair. But my father... Would you like to hear one thing? I'm just going to let it go for a while. But I appreciate the thought. Good. Maybe that's enough. If you need anything, go ahead and get it yourself. That's what I needed. And we're not so different. I'm so sad, Mommy. I have something for you. Do you now? A shield? Oh, and born by the one true Sir Aveline. Lovely. Thank you. Um... I'm sorry. I don't see where I went wrong. I have a shield. It belonged to Wesley. You seem to recognize its worth as you pass it around. Are you suggesting that I give it up entirely? Pawn it away and be done with it? No. You're taking this a bit seriously. If you didn't think this would upset me, what was your intent? To be nice? It's not enough to want you to be happy. Happy is for fools. Okay, it's not the shield, is it? No, and it's not Wesley. You've got me doing a lot of things. Some I don't agree with. Some I'm surprised I do. I'm not sure where I'm going as it is. Replacing what I was with this. I mean, who is Sarah Aveline to me? You don't have to be so mean to me. I just lost my mom. <laughs> I thought of you when I found it. Maybe that was foolish. I can appreciate that. Then accept it on those merits. Nothing more. It is... a fine shield. You do know that Orlesian Smith slapped Sir Aveline's name on every second piece of armor. This didn't really belong to her. It does now. This is true, it does now. That's cool. Nothing going on, Hawk. You'd be the first to know if there was. I better be the first to know if there wasn't a friggin' fritter 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 fritter. I am so Hope the day is treating you well, Sarah. We've gone from depression to rage just like that. All will pay. Even you. It is apparently not enough that the Kunari define my political life. They must also infect what I hold personal. It is my son, Seamus. The life you saved, he would now squander by converting to the Kun. He has left for the Kunari compound. Uh... Please, Sarah Hawk. Convince Seamus to come home. I'll try, but... The Arishov says nothing good about Kirkwall, yet he accepts conversions? I cannot understand him. Maker knows I've tried, but he landed with, what, a few hundred men? Add up the deaths and defections, and the Arishok must need to bolster his ranks. I'm sure my son is quite the symbolic prize. Maybe, but I have to cut the video off here, so when we come back, more Dragon Age 2. Thanks for watching, guys.